why the biggest companies are important for your portfolio and how to hold them forever. Some investors prefer to actively manage their portfolio but others would rather purchase stocks and hold on to their shares for as long as possible, or even forever. However, it's easier said than done. Hello everyone. It's me again Sophie, one of Tony's team members. Today, we'll talk about the stock picks you should buy and hold forever. Don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button and share this video. You can't just buy any stock and decide to hold it indefinitely. You will find a lot of great companies that did pretty well at first but plummeted in the end. You need to find stocks that have sustainable business models. You need to find leading companies with an excellent reputation as well as solid and growing balance sheets. So, how do you know which stocks to pick? There are six stock picks you need to add to your portfolio right now and hold forever. Apple. Apple is a massive company and in the technology space. It's no wonder why investors are adding this stock into their portfolios. If you didn't know, Apple is the single largest stock that's been held by Warren Buffett's Berkshire Hathaway, one of the best-managed investment conglomerates in the world. Apple continues to be one of the leading brands when it comes to consumer hardware. It has also established its authority within the subscription services and software space. The company is also expected to be a leader in the mobile hardware space given that augmented reality, 5G, and wearable computing continue to evolve. There's a lot going on with Apple. Its stock sold off back last Friday after the federal court's ruling that the company must allow app developers like Fortnite developer Epic to offer other payment methods aside from its own payment systems. The ruling comes a few days before the company's scheduled launch of its brand new iPhone 13. Even with all these issues, Apple remains to be a reputable, profitable, and stable company, making its stock an ideal addition to your portfolio. The next one is Amazon. Just like Apple, Amazon is also dominating the technology space. It's considered as one of the most influential companies in the world that are expected to continue innovating and improving over time. It's a leading company in the e-commerce and cloud infrastructure space. It has established a strong presence when it comes to digital advertising and is expected to benefit from the expanding market for digital ads. Amazon has immense resources that it could invest to scale up and strengthen its business. The stock has been performing extremely well and it's showing no signs of stopping, making it yet another ideal stock to add to your portfolio. As for Amazon, sources reveal that the tech giant is the front-runner in terms of the ongoing negotiation to get the rights for the National Football League's NFL Sunday Ticket Package. If it manages to secure the deal, it'll be a great addition to the exclusive NFL broadcast package it currently owns. The company's Amazon Prime Video is the first streaming service to become the exclusive provider of Thursday NFL football games, which will start next year. Amazon has some serious competition, like Disney and Apple, for the Sunday game rights. Next is Google. Google is under the holding company, Alphabet, which manages profitable businesses including YouTube, Google Maps, and Google Cloud. Its flagship product is Google Search and it has little competition aside from Microsoft's Bing and DuckDuckGo. It owns Android, a mobile operating system that dominates the smartphone market and its biggest competitor is Apple's iPhone. Google's revenue jumped by 62% year-over-year to a whopping $61.9 billion in the second quarter. Its operating income rose to $19.4 billion. Among Alphabet's businesses, YouTube was the best performer in Q2. Its revenue increased by 84% year-over-year to $7 billion. Google's businesses play crucial roles in the lives of consumers and that's why investors like you should include this stock in your portfolio and keep it for the long term. Millions of people across the world use YouTube, Google Search, and Google Maps for the years to come and there are no signs that this trend will stop anytime soon. The next stock is Facebook. Facebook's revenue surged by 56% to $29.1 billion in the second quarter. The increase can be attributed to the 47% increase in ad prices. However, the company was unable to match the bar set by Twitter, Snap, 
an alphabet which may have been driven by the effect caused by Apple's privacy change. As for the latest news with Facebook, the social media giant recently launched its new Ray-Ban Stories smart glasses. It comes with a built-in camera that can take photos and record short videos. It also allows phone calls and filming through voice control. Facebook also launched its Facebook View app where users can edit and share their content easier by using these smart glasses. Facebook has proven that it can weather an economic downturn. It may be facing a lot of regulatory threats and possible headwinds caused by higher interest rates and taxes but investors are advised not to bet against this stock. Facebook remains to be one of the stocks that's worth adding to your portfolio and holding for a long time. Another stock is Tesla. Tesla is definitely a stock you need to buy and hold for a long time. The company's revenue reached $11.96 billion, which surpassed the estimates of $11.53 billion. Its adjusted earnings skyrocketed by 230%, which means it now costs $1.45 per share. The company's deliveries increased by 121% year over year. It managed to deliver 201,304 during the second quarter, which surpassed its previous record of 184, 877 in the first quarter. The company is planning to start production for its Model Y vehicles in Austin and Berlin this year. However, its widely anticipated Roadster will be moved to at least 2023 while Tesla's Cybertruck is expected to be launched in late 2022. And the last stock is Netflix. Netflix's stock hit an all-time high last Tuesday despite facing headwinds like negative operating and free cash flow and high content costs. Analysts expect the streaming service to grow its earnings per share by as much as 23% next year. It's home to more than 15,000 titles, with 1,500 titles which are original films produced by Netflix. Its subscribers increased by 1.5 million, beating Wall Street's expectations of 1.15 million. Netflix believes it'll add 3.5 million subscribers more. In Q2, the company earned about $2.97 a share of its sales that reached $7.3 billion. Netflix expects its sales to reach $7.48 billion in the third quarter. So, that's it for today. Please share this video if you found it useful and informative. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Feel free to drop your comments, suggestions, or tips below. We'd love to hear from you. Also, please don't forget to watch our other investing videos. So, until next time. Stay very motivated.